Hey guys, uh, let's go over a monster scalper update for the week. Had a great run in the pairs that we are trading, the dollar pairs, the cat pairs. Uh, so let's go over um, those pairs. So Aussie dollar, here's the buy signal here. And um, we started adding, I think right about in here, we started adding uh, positions and this pair is holding really well. Uh, held support and now is looking to test um, resistance when the market opens uh, on Sunday. Uh, that's Aussie dollar. Uh, Aussie uh, euro dollar, euro dollar buy signal was right here and price is holding here. And I know we made a change from the 30 minute to the to the uh, 240 minute time frame, the forward chart. And I, I know that's a bit. Uh, takes a bit getting used to, um, but stick with the 240 guys, when, when when the pairs run, we can really capture some really good profits um, with that pair. Also below here is the daily time frame, so we can see at a glance the 240 and the daily. Alright, so we got a buy signal here on the daily, um, price is holding on the daily, but our trading window is the 240 here. Okay, uh, New Zealand dollar, same thing. Um, buy signal here, price held support, and hopefully uh, tomorrow Sunday it will test resistance up here. Here's the daily, and it's trending really nice on the daily. Okay, so work that 240, right? So work the 240 minute time frame. Like I said, I know it takes a bit getting used to, um, but once you master it, 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 it works great and saves you a lot of time. Here is uh, the pound dollar, pound dollar, uh, buy signal here, green candles here, price is moving higher, held support here on the 240 minute time frame, and uh, hopefully we'll hold support here and test this resistance. Big moves in the um, Aussie CAD pair. So Aussie CAD, uh, right here was our buy signal here, held support here guys, and look at this move up here on the 240 minute time frame, just a big move here on Aussie uh, CAD, Euro CAD, same thing, buy signal was here, and uh, never really retraced, uh, retraced just a bit here, and uh, move it up nicely, um, here was our buy signal here on the daily time frame, Okay, held support on the daily, and price is moving higher right here. New Zealand CAD, same thing here. So another CAD pair, buy signal here on the break of resistance right here, buy signal here, and here is price moving higher. Okay, we are watching going into um, um, next week, Sunday, um, we are watching Aussie. Yen, Aussie Yen, which gave a buy signal here. So we look to get into this pair, depending on what it does on um, on on Sunday uh, or early next week. If it breaks this resistance here, we look to get in. Uh, same thing with um, Aussie uh, Euro Yen, Euro Yen. Same thing here, buy signal here. We traced a bit and held, but we're looking at the daily right here. We've got. Uh, several days, almost, uh, let's see, a uh, little bit two weeks of consolidation right between support and resistance on the daily time frame. So we're watching those pairs. But great move. The pairs finally broke out. Uh, so that's exciting news. Stay with those pairs, guys. Hang in there, okay?